Bridget and I just got back home to Australia from all the way in the USA where we joined our newly found biological family for our first ever Thanksgiving. After receiving hundreds of comments, there were two main pieces of Thanksgiving advice. The first was to wear stretchy pants because you're gonna be eating so much food. And the second was to be warned about the unofficial tradition of the afternoon nap. I've got plenty of sweatpants and comfy couch attire. And after doing six years of morning radio and getting up at 4.30 a.m., I'm an absolute pro at the afternoon nap. I would also like to take this opportunity to say I'm aware when I filmed this, I had something in my teeth. But I asked people on Instagram if I needed to refilm it and 71% said, no, it's fine. So let's continue. We had a quick stop over in Los Angeles so Bridget could visit her favorite shop. To the home. <laughs> we went surfing at Venice Beach and we finally arrived at our final destination. Where are we? Um, oh, New Orleans. <laughs> <laughs> and who are we going to meet for the first time today? Um, your granddad? Yep. Your dad's dad. And yes, I did meet my biological grandfather for the first time. If you don't know the full backstory why, I'll put a link explaining below. But have a look at this picture. Do you think there are any similarities? How do we know each other? They're my grandson. That's right. This is my biological grandpa. <laughs> Thanks for having me into the family. It's wonderful. Wonderful. What a Christmas present I got three years ago. <laughs> While we were in New Orleans, we did some touristy stuff like see some street music in the French Quarter, eat a muffin letter at Central Grocery, and watch New Orleans take on the Lakers at Smoothie King Stadium. How you liking your first NBA game? It's so much fun. <laughs> I'd previously met my biological father and my half-brothers, but this was the first time I met aunties, uncles, grandparents, cousins, cousins-in-law, everyone. Everyone wave to Australia who's at work today. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving from New Orleans. <laughs> For Thanksgiving dinner itself, there were 18 people sitting around that big table and we travelled from three different countries and five different states, so even just being in the same room was something to be thankful for. But something that the family did that I really liked, and our family in Australia actually does something similar at Christmas, is we went around the table and everyone said something they were thankful for. There's lots of hugs and happy tears, and it's still, even now, it still hasn't quite sunk in that I've met this other family on the other side of the world. It's weird to think that just two years ago, I had never met any of these guys. They didn't even know I existed. I was just living in Australia, minding my own business, <laughs> uh, and probably just had accepted that uh, as an adopted child, you're probably never gonna meet anyone from your biological family uh, until you have children of your own. And then two years later, here I am with my fiance um, in a room of my biological family. It was a really special moment. And like I said, it was uh, quite beautiful and a few tears in the room as well. Um, but yeah, it was, it was really nice. It, well, this could be the last video ever because there's what, 25 yeah. or <laughs> Thank you to everyone who gave advice in the last video. It actually proved to be really, really helpful on our trip to the US, so thank you so much. And stay tuned to this channel. Uh, give it a like or a follow or a subscribe, depending where you're watching because the next video is a new game show and it's called How Well Does My Biological American Family Know Australia? Is there like shouting involved? In my head there's shouting involved. Not normally, but knowing you there could be. So. <laughs> Sounds like some kind of bomb or something, like a hobo. Like, you should know more than everyone else because you spent a lot of time in Australia. No one wow, knows that. There we go. You, you did teach me that a while ago. I did. I did. <laughs> oh, I did. <laughs> this is why my brothers are so short. This is their mum Beth. <laughs> Don't forget to give this video a big ol' thumbs up and I'll chat to you soon.